the, um, oh gosh, hold on. It is the move limitation divi division. So this division is six competitors. They had move restrictions, but they still are being held to the exacting standards that our expert division is held to. They had no restrictions in their moves, so it's kind of anything goes in that division. And we have eight competitors in that division. Well, and we have the judges here. And of course, if you're in the bowl community, you've got to know these people. This is Alethea Awesome. Awesome. We call her Alethea Awesome as a judge. So let's talk a little bit about Alethea. Hold on. She was a former U.S. pole dance champion. She's also one of the most notorious names in pole, we'd like to say. She has been in the business probably, I don't know, one of the longest in the business so far. Um, she is the owner of Chrome Bar. She is currently producing and directing a really cool show called Live Dancing Girls. It's rock and pull and everything awesome, which Alethea Awesome is known for. And she is doing that with her best buddy, Carol, who also has been in the business a long time. We've got a panel of very seasoned judges this year. Carol is US PDF Miss Sexy 2010. She is third place uh, 2012 US PDF. This is her third year at the festival, which is really awesome because the festival has been going on in this venue for three years, I think. Yeah, three years. Um, and she loves it. She loves Detroit. She likes being here. She likes seeing all of you guys. She's also the official ex poll girl. So if you have ex poll questions or want to buy one of the polls at the end of competition that are upstairs in the um, the rooms where people are taking classes, you can do that, and she would be, all of the judges would be great to talk to you about the different polls. And she's also a brand kitty ambassador um, for their pole fit line, which I actually have some pieces too, it's awesome. Do you have some pieces of it? Do I have pieces of bad, bad kitty? Bad kitty pole wear? I have no pieces of bad kitty pole wear. None have been left at your house? None. Trans, well maybe we can change that this year for you, Evan. It's possible. <laughs> okay, so who else do we have on the? Well, this is Miss Michelle Manx. She has come to the Chicago area. St. Louis. St. Louis Arch. That's where the arch is. Right? And I think there's a bit of a competition tonight because the thing I like the most about the two ladies up here, Alethea and Michelle, they both wear a lot of red lipstick. And that's a thing. I love that. So I don't know. We might have to have a red lipstick wear off maybe this weekend. See who can wear the most red lipstick through the weekend. Something like that. Um, Michelle Makes also has her own studio. Michelle Makes Academy. Uh, she is on her seventh year of her student extravaganza, which is a benefit for sexual assault victims unit. Um, she is also half of Gravity Play's favorites, which I'm sure a lot of you know. They've been doing that uh, acro burlesque and pole act since 2005 out of clubs, but she's been dancing a lot longer than that in clubs and beyond, and also travels and really knows how to take a show on the road. So our last up is David. C. Owen. David has been pole dancing for over four years and he likes to drink coffee, eat a lot of cheese, and sing silly songs. So maybe David could sing a silly song and do one of his sexy, bendy, flexy, crotchy moves while drinking coffee. Upside down. Upside down. And eating cheese. I think it should be string cheese. Well, string cheese. <laughs> All well, right, that's sorry. enough. I mean, we're here to see girls dance. We're here to see girls dance. Let's give it up for our judges real quick. Let's give it up for our judges. Let's give it up for the show. All right, so we have six competitors in this division. This is the apprentice division, which I completely blanked on a minute ago. Sorry about that. Um, so do you want to read the names? And I'll go back and give a little back. I have the names. Well, as we get to each competitor, I'll do a quick little bio about that. Go for it. Selena Feline? Yeah. Yep, so she's Woo! up first over there in the red. Can I just your last name? Feline. Feline. That's way sexier. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 <It's free. laughs> so Selene, uh, Selena has been studying, learning, eating, sleeping, breathing, call it what you will, pole dance for a couple of years now. Her style tends towards artistic expression, as she enjoys both the athleticism and the artistry that can be played with and developed in polling. Uh, Selena appreciates 
most any type of music as long as it inspires her to move and dance. Sometimes upon hearing a song or thinking of a performance concept, a seed of the desire to create will be planted in her heart and in her brain and will sit demanding that she allow it to blossom into a routine. Selena is proud to present to you one such seed that has been laying dormant since she was here at Pole Fest last year, 2013. Let's give it up for Selena.